My oldest daughter was in fifth grade and she gets off the bus. I can hear her mom say, we need to tell daddy. She goes, I don't, I don't want to tell daddy. And so I hear this, I look around, I'm like, what do you not want to tell daddy? She's like, well, a boy likes me at school. Do you like him? She starts to blush. And I said, sweetheart, if you like him, that's fine. Any boy that recognizes how wonderful and beautiful and smart you are speaks very well of him. So I'm already inclined to think that at least this boy has good judgment, even if he's dabbling with death right now. And you know, she kind of laughs. She goes, I told him that we're not allowed to date. What'd he say? He said he'll wait. Keep in mind, this is fifth grade. You gotta respect the riz, right? As the kids say. Do you know why we don't let you date? And she goes, yeah, daddy, I, I know why. I said, okay, ex explain it to me. And she goes, we're not old enough to get married. And if we're not in a position to be able to seriously consider marriage, well then we should focus on things like our education. I said, yeah, sweetheart, that's true. And I'm saying this to you as your dad, who is never gonna think any boy is good enough for you. I want you to get married one day. And I want you to have the kind of relationship that your mother and I do. You are gonna find that man and he is going to sweep you off your feet. And I don't want you to have to explain all the guys that came before him. I want you to be very, very confident when you meet him that he's the guy for you and that you are the girl for him. I want you to meet a man that is worthy of you and for you to be worthy of him. And here's what that led to, is that same daughter is now going to be walking down the aisle very, very soon with a guy that is a great guy. A guy that I had no trouble telling him, yes, you can marry my daughter.